Welcome to the second tutorial out of four showing you how to use countdowns within HipFilm. This example is what I call line by line. Find this example on an Inkscape digital tutorial and I've included the link as a thank you for creating it in the first place because I wouldn't have seen it. It's good for a few numbers at a time and what you do is you start off with minutes or seconds and for every number you want to change down or up you uh, copy, paste and edit it. So let's get on to the actual composite and as you can see I've created uh, the numbers. All it is is a text layer with your number in it and you can change the font so as you can see look that's all it is just basic text and um, like I said you can change the, the, uh, the text all that you like obviously you can I'll do this one at a time you know, I'll, uh, I'll change it as uh, impact for example and then you copy and paste it like I would have done there as you can see then I'll change it to 20 19, 18, 17, 16, 15 now if I want to 14, I'll just duplicate that one and then I move it over. Make sure you put this cursor over there, so it makes it easier to select the right one. Trust me, it is a pain. Go on. Let's change the get down, just points in there. And now you should see number 14. Now, obviously, if you wanted 60 seconds, you didn't have to do 60 of these, and obviously, two minutes, 120, etc. etc. So, it's good for a little, you know, countdown clock reminder, um, you know, if you're in your production saying, you know, you've got two minutes to go, have a quick point at the clock, two minutes, 159, etc go back to the action and then come back to it. It's very quick as you see, copy paste, change the number, not a lot more to talk about this one. Thank you for watching and go and check my tutorial out. Thank you.